mandated production cutoff of R22 will go into effect on January 1st, 2020. There is only one cooling season remaining. Have you prepared your facility and equipment? Beginning January 1st, 2015, the Environmental Protection Agency adjusted the allowance system for the production of hydrochlorofluorocarbons in accordance with the Clean Air Act. Over the past four years, the amount of R22 allowed in the United States has been decreasing. On January 1st, 2020, due to the EPA's mandatory phase-out, there will be no new or imported R22 refrigerant allowed in the U.S. With this in mind, it is critical to have a plan to manage your equipment and refrigeration. Record Keeping Equipment owners are legally responsible to keep equipment maintenance records. For REEK maintenance customers, we have kept those records for you. Repair leaks and maintain equipment performance. This is not only the right thing to do for the environment, but refrigerant loss is in direct correlation with how well your system operates. Retrofit existing equipment with R22 alternatives. Replace equipment that has reached the end of its useful life. This is a necessary part of your equipment plan. Let the experts at REEK Services work with you to determine the best option for your existing equipment. Recover refrigerant from equipment before disposing of it or before putting in another gas. Recycle by putting gas back into another piece of equipment owned by the same owner. Reclaiming refrigerant means reprocessing it by returning it to a refrigerant reclaim center for proper EPA processing. Refrigerant reclamation facilities must be certified by the US EPA. Need help developing your refrigerant management plan? Contact REEK Services today 